Tonight is opening night of the Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular over at Roger Williams Park Zoo. 12 News reporter Amanda Pitts joins us now live from Providence with a preview. Amanda? Yeah, hey Mike, we are at the Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular opening night here. You'll see there are thousands of pumpkins behind me, but no people just yet. That's because doors open don't open until 6 o'clock. But you know who is here? Stacy Johnson, Executive Director of the park. Stacy, thanks for joining us. Thanks, Amanda. It's great to be here. Now, I know you've done some counting. Just how many pumpkins are here this year? So I counted the ones behind us, and there are only 60. But there are actually about 5,000 more on the trail. It's a big bunch of pumpkins. And they're not just on the ground. I mean, if you look up above us, they're up in the trees, too. It's amazing. Tell me, every year you have a different theme. Last year it was TV. Yep. You're hinting at this year's theme with your tie. Yep, it's see the world with wanderlust. So we're exploring the whole world. And there's a, there's a whole bunch of different things out there, geographic, wildlife, um, mysterious creatures, modes of travel. I was looking at a, at a pumpkin just a few minutes ago that has a, a train like from the Transcontinental Railroad on it. Amazing. Tell me when people walk through, what will they see? So what they're going to do is they're going to experience this wonderful trail that has, you know, all the, all the, the beautiful greenery and the lush park like setting and, the, and our wetlands completely surrounded by all these artistically carved jack-o'-lanterns. There's some of them are whimsical, some of them are scary, some of them are funny, uh, but, but the attention to detail and the, and the artistic quality of these pumpkins just will blow you away. How many people are you expecting this year? We're, we targeted about 130,000, but if the weather stays good, we hope it's a lot more than that because it's a really fun way to spend the evening and, and sort of celebrate the holiday. You had quite a record number last year. We did. We hit over 170,000 last year, so we're hoping, to, we're hoping to reach that again this time. Stacey Johnson, thank you for joining us. Appreciate it. It's a great to be here. Let's go have some fun. Yes. If you are at home wanting to have some fun down here, buy your tickets online. You will not be able to purchase them at the door. Buy your tickets online. This is a rain or shine event. Doors open at 6 o'clock, and the last person in the door is at 10 o'clock. This whole thing wraps up at 1030 each night. Live in Providence, Amanda Pitts, 12 News.